The word of the Lord that came to Micah the Morassite in the days of Jotham, Ahaz, and Hezekiah, kings of Judah, which he saw concerning Samaria and Jerusalem. Hear, all ye people, hearken, O earth, and all that therein is, and let the Lord God be witness against you, the Lord from his holy temple. For, behold, the Lord cometh forth out of his place, and will come down, and tread upon the high places of the earth. And the mountain shall be molten under him, and the valley shall be cleft as wax before the fire, and as the waters that are poured down a steep place. For the transgression of Jacob is all this, and for the sins of the house of Israel. What is the transgression of Jacob? Is it not Samaria? And what are the high places of Judah? Are they not Jerusalem? Therefore I will make Samaria as an heap of the field, and as plantings of a vineyard, and I will pour down the stones thereof into the valley, and I will discover the foundations thereof, and all the graven images thereof shall be beaten to pieces, and all the hires thereof shall be burned with the fire, and all the idols thereof will I lay desolate, for she gathered it of the hire of an harlot, and they shall return to the hire of an harlot. Therefore I will wail and howl, I will go stripped and naked, I will make a wailing like the dragons, and mourning as the owls. For her wound is incurable, for it is come unto Judah. He is come unto the gate of my people, even to Jerusalem. Declare ye it not at Gath. Weep ye not at all in the house of Aphra. Roll thyself in the dust. Pass ye away, thou inhabitant of Saphir. Having thy shame naked, the inhabitant of Zanan came not forth in the morning of Bethesel. He shall receive of you his standing. For the inhabitant of Maroth waited carefully for good, but evil came down from the Lord unto the gate of Jerusalem. O thou inhabitant of Lachish, bind the chariot to the swift beast. She is the beginning of the sin to the daughter of Zion, for the transgressions of Israel were found in thee. Therefore shalt thou give presents to Morshethgath. The houses of Akzib shall be a lie to the kings of Israel. Yet will I bring a hair unto thee, O inhabitant of Mersha. He shall come unto Adullam, the glory of Israel. Make thee bald, and pull thee for thy delicate children. Enlarge thy baldness as the eagle, for they are gone into captivity from thee.